William Somerset Maugham, a successful English writer, 1874 to 1965. William Somerset Maugham was born on 25th January 1874 in France. Maugham was orphaned at the age of 10. He was brought up by an uncle and educated at King's School, Canterbury. After a year at Heidelberg, he entered St Thomas Medical School, London. and qualified as a doctor in 1897 he drew upon his experiences as an obstetrician in his first novel lisa of lambeth 1897 and its success though small encouraged him to abandon medicine he traveled in spain and italy and in 1908 achieved a theatrical triumph four plays running in london at once that brought him financial security During World War 1 he worked as a secret agent after the war he resumed his interrupted travels and in 1928 bought a villa on Cape Ferrar in the south of France which became his permanent home mom began contributing to magazines and periodicals initially these were short stories but he also wrote opinion pieces non-fictional and autobiographical work and letters Much of his non-fictional writing was published in book form and covered a range of topics including travel, current affairs, autobiography and Bell's letters. Mom was also editor on a number of works which often included adding a preface or introductory chapter to the work of other writers. In 1903 his first play was performed A Man of Honor at the Imperial Theatre London. It was the first of many of his works that were produced for the stage and with the later development of cinema his novels and stories were also adapted for the big screen for example trio the razor's age of human bondage rain and many more his reputation as a novelist rests primarily on four books of human bondage 1915 a semi autobiographical account of a young medical students painful progress towards maturity the moon and sixpence 1919 an account of an unconventional artist suggested by the life of paul gauguin cakes and l 1930 the story of a famous novelist which is thought to contain caricatures of thomas hardy and hugh walpole and the razor's age 1944 the story of a young american war veteran's quest for a satisfying way of life mom's plays mainly edwardian social comedies soon became dated but his short stories have increased in popularity many portray the conflict of europeans in alien surroundings that provoke strong emotions and mom's skill in handling plot in the manner of guy de maupassant is distinguished by economy and suspense in the summing of 1938 and a writer's notebook 1949 mom explains his philosophy of life as a resigned atheism and a certain skepticism about the extent of man's innate goodness and intelligence it is this that gives his work its astringent cynicism mom's public view of his abilities remained modest toward the end of his career he described himself as in the very first row of the second readers in 1948 he wrote great novelists and their novels also known as ten novels and their authors and the art of fiction in which he listed the ten best novels of world literature in his view Mom was appointed a companion of honor in the 1954 birthday honors. Mom had began collecting theatrical paintings before the First World War. He continued to the point where his collection was second only to that of the Garrick Club. In 1948 he announced that he would bequeath this collection to the trustees of the National Theatre from 1951 some 14 years before his death his paintings began their exhibition commercial success with high book sales successful theater production and a string of film adaptations backed by astute stock market investments allowed mom to live a very comfortable life william somerset mom ch was an english playwright novelist and short story writer
by the time of his death on 16th december 1965 mom was one of the most commercially successful and gifted writers of the 20th century according to byron cannon his biographer the times obituarist called mom the most assured english writer of his time and it's true thank you